Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to share my nighttime skincare routine. This is a very highly requested video here in my channel, and I've been meaning to do this for so long. I get asked so many questions on what I use for skincare. I'm not sure why, because I never really talk about skincare on my channel. It's mostly like makeup and like just other things um, besides skincare, but I've been really into my skincare lately and really trying to take care of my skin because if you take care of your skin, then your makeup's gonna look good, you know? So um, I've been really into it. I've been, these products are just amazing. I mean, they're, they're working for me. They might not work for everybody, but for me, they're doing wonders and I cannot wait to share them with you all. So if you're new to my channel, welcome. My name is Lisa. I love to do beauty videos and I love connecting with my subscribers. So I hope that you guys subscribe and stay a while and I hope you enjoy the video. I wanna talk a little bit about my skin just to let you guys all know I am combination. In the summertime, I am not as oily as, as I used to be, so I'm still on that combo side. Sometimes I can still get a little dry around the nose and around the chin and just like on the, the outer parts of my face and then obviously in the T-zone, especially around my pores, I do get a little bit more oily and then in the winter time, I, I'm basically just dry, <laughs> like super, super dry because here in Alberta, Canada, it is just extremely dry in the winter time. The first thing that I do is remove my eye makeup. Now, this stuff here, I have repurchased so many times, I can't even tell you. Since I discovered it, I have not tried anything else, nor will I ever probably try anything else, to be honest with you, because this just works for me like wonders. It just gets everything off, and I don't have to work hard at it at all. So this is from the brand Marcel, which is a Canadian brand that you can get at most drugstores. And it's this is the instant eye makeup remover, waterproof, oil-free, and it is paraben-free, perfume-free, perfume, perfume and hypoallergenic. So it is very good for your skin. And this is just amazing. It just melts off your eye makeup. And I do not want anything that's gonna pull and tug on my eyes because that will just cause more creasing and more fine lines, and I do not want that. By the way, if you have oily skin, be very grateful for that because people with oily skin will have less wrinkles when they're older. So yeah, it's not that bad to have oily skin. So this stuff is just, it's so, so, so good that I will not try anything else, not at the moment anyways. This is just my ride or die, holy grail, can't be without. Before I started using this next product, I used to use makeup wipes and go through them like nobody's business. Like, I just, I can't even tell you how many makeup wipes I have gone through. Now, they are nice and convenient, you know, if you're away and you don't really want to pack a whole bunch of stuff with you. Um, makeup remover wipes are really nice to travel with. But I have noticed since I stopped using them that my skin is not as irritated. And it doesn't matter what brand I try. It could be like the softest ones or like the, you know, more, more for sensitive skin. I will still get some sort of redness or itchiness from it and just irritate it. So I stopped using makeup wipes completely and I have gone to, you can use coconut oil, which I still, still do use every once in a while, but I use jojoba oil. This is, oh, my skin feels so good after I use this and it's gonna help over time as well too. It's gonna help with like um, age spots, dark spots, and your, you know, just your fine lines and it just leaves your skin so soft. And I just love using it. And you can use jojoba oil for so many things. I even use it in my hair. Um, I will even mix it with coconut oil. <laughs> it's just, it's it's really, really good. Now this is from the brand Now, now Solutions and it's 100% pure organic. So yeah, it's good for your body, hair, skin, and it's just, amazing this is all that i use to take off my makeup it's either this or coconut oil but i do prefer this stuff people often ask me why i use oil for my combination oily skin but honestly that is the best thing that you can do for yourself when you have um, oily skin it's actually going to help you so that's why i use it and i actually even 
will use this as a moisturizer sometimes if I'm like super dry in the winter time. I'm not doing that right now, but sometimes I will use this to do that as well. Jehovah oil, believe it or not, is actually really good for hair loss and it's also good for people with acne as well too. So if you're tired of buying makeup wipes, this is something that I would definitely try and it's very affordable. This was very inexpensive. I'm gonna have everything linked down below for you guys. I don't remember how much this was exactly, but it's really inexpensive and I started using this bottle back in I would say I think it was mid-December so that tells you how much this will last you I use two products to actually cleanse my skin once not really a cleanser but you can use it as a cleanser um, but the reason why I do that is to kind of just get rid of whatever is left over from the Jehovah oil because it, it is a little bit on the thicker side. And I like to cleanse twice anyways because I want to make sure that I remove any makeup or dirt that is left on the skin. And sometimes when you're wearing a lot of makeup, you, you should actually cleanse twice. And if you guys notice, if you go into a spa and you get a facial, they will usually cleanse your face twice because they want to make sure that it is perfectly clean for them to work on. One of the cleansers that I use is from Amore Pacific and this is their Treatment Enzyme Peel Botanical Exfoliator. So this is a very, very gentle exfoliator, but this is what I use first. It's a powder that you mix in with water and you guys, if you try this stuff, you will fall in love because the smell alone is just so good. Like it smells so nice when you're putting it on. And it's not a strong smell like I can't really describe the smell but it is just so soothing and it relaxes me every time I put it on and my skin is so soft and it's just glowing within and it looks clean and fresh it just looks so good I don't even want to put anything else on my face after I use this that's how good my skin looks so I love this stuff it's so good very gentle to use every single day Prior to using this, my skin looked uneven and really dull, and this stuff just really brightens my skin up. So that's one thing that I have noticed since I started using this stuff. I just think this is a great product, and I definitely want to try more from this brand. Next is by Peter Thomas Roth, and this is actually a kit that I got from Sephora, and I wanted to try it out. I was reading um, reviews on it, and a lot of people were swearing by it. Now, I do suffer from hormonal acne so that's one of the main reasons why I wanted to try this and I wanted a product that would treat my acne before it even appears on my skin because my skin will do that sometimes especially around the time that my girlfriend comes you know you know when your girlfriend comes every single month yeah you guys know what I'm talking about <laughs> but anyways usually that's the time that I break out is during my cycle I will have to say before Prior to using this stuff, I have changed my diet completely. So although the skincare is really helping, I do feel like a lot of it has to do with my diet as well. I have cut out sugar completely and I know now for sure that sugar breaks me out. And he designed this for people that are suffering from acne. And this stuff works. Like this cleanser is one of those cleansers that will help prevent future breakouts. And again, this one actually smells really, really nice. And it doesn't dry out my skin either because I have tried a lot of like acne cleansers that's really, really dry out my skin. Um, now, I'm, I don't know how it's going to work for me in the winter time. I do feel like if I use it when my skin is more on the drier side that it might dry it out a little bit. But for right now, it is working, it is doing the job. It has 2% salicy salicylic acid, sorry, um, and it's alcohol free. It's medicated gel cleanser to help prevent and treat acne. And I feel like it just does all of that and my skin feels super, super clean after I use this. So I really like this. I'm even considering even getting the full size of it, but I mean, this is gonna last me a really long time because a little bit goes a long way. I'm just gonna get this product out of the way because it came in the kit, but it's just not working for me. It, I don't feel like it's doing anything, to be honest. I've tried other acne spot treatments that work better than this one. I just don't notice a difference at all. I feel like it's taking my um, acne spots longer <laughs> to go away, to be honest with you. So this I'm actually not really a fan of, um, but I'm gonna continue, continue using it just so that I do use it up. After I'm done doing my cleansing, I will move on to these pads right here, and this is the Max Complexion Correction Pads. 
I feel like this has changed the texture of my skin and my skin looks tighter. I cannot explain it. It feels so good once it's on. And this is gonna last me a really long time. Now, in the beginning, I was taking out these pads. I'll just show you what the pad looks like. I do not need a whole pad of this. And I was watching, no, I wasn't watching. I was actually reading reviews and one girl just cuts them in half. Genius, like why did I not think of that? So I'm gonna start cutting the ones that I have left. I only have three left, oh my goodness. I'm gonna be really sad once this stuff is gone, but it is just so good. It has cleared up my skin so much, especially like around my pores. Like I feel like that texture that I had in the large pores that I have is actually like shrinking it. Like no joke, it is so good. My lines look finer. I don't feel like I have as many, especially on my forehead and even like my smile lines, I have noticed it has been um, less since I started using that stuff. I do feel like this has changed the texture in my over overall look of my skin, especially when I'm putting on my makeup. It just, it looks just more even. Now that I have tried this in a kit, this is definitely something that I would repurchase in the full size. I don't believe this is the full size. Um, so yeah, I'm definitely going to be repurchasing these as soon as I'm out and I'm going to cut these pads in half. <laughs> Next is this AHA BHA Acne Cleansing Gel. Now this is supposed to help with blemishes, which yes, it totally helps with my blemishes. I do not notice them as much at all. I feel it working every time I put this on. So this is something that I will use after I put this on. Like it is... To me, this is like a treatment, you know? And this also has been helping with my fine lines. I feel like these two products together have really helped the texture of my skin, my pores, and just all my fine lines that I had around my mouth and especially around my forehead. I do feel like this has worked. And even for future breakouts, like I don't break out as much as I used to. And like I said, I don't know if it's these products that I'm using or if it's the diet that I have changed or maybe it's the combination of both. Like, I, I don't know. I'm just I've been so happy with my skin lately that I'm, I'm just going to continue using this stuff. Okay. I will move on to this eye cream. Now, I just finished this eye cream. I have a like just a little bit left, so I had to cut the top off because I know that there was some at the bottom and I probably have another five more uses of this stuff. This lasted me so long. Like I even bought the stuff back in January and I'm just using it up now. So this is the Vasanti Eye Wonder 2.0 Super Powered Eye Cream and it is the best eye cream that I have used so far. And it's not really expensive like some other eye, eye creams at Sephora. I think this is like around like $40. But I just really like this because it helps with my dark circles and my fine lines and it helps fill in my fine lines. Like my under eyes look so smooth and when I put my concealer on, it even looks even better. So morning and night, the best eye cream that I have used. This is also cruelty free, vegan, gluten, paraffin free, and 95% natural and made in Canada. I definitely see myself repurchasing this in the future. I do have one more eye cream that I want to try next that I had in my collection. And if that doesn't work, I'm definitely going to be going back for this one. And the last product is a facial oil. And you guys, if I'm very lazy at nighttime, this is something do, that I do not skip out. I always use a facial oil. I think for me personally, they work the best because it really helps get into all those layers of your skin. And this stuff has been all of the facial oils that I have tried. And you guys, I've tried a lot of facial oils, like a lot of them because I'm just addicted to them. Like I love using facial oils and they just smell so good. This one is not the greatest smelling one, but I don't care because I see results and it works. So for me, uh, whatever. Uh, this is the herbivore, herbivore. <laughs> I don't even know if I'm saying that right. Tell me if I'm saying that wrong. Um, lapis facial oil. Now, this reminds me so much of the Luna oil, and that's exactly what the lady at Sephora said. She said this is very comparable to that, but a little bit more affordable, and this is also made in the US. I think the Luna oil might be made in France or something like that, so I think that's why it's a little bit more expensive, but it kind of works the same. I told her I was looking for something that would help with texture and pores, because that is something that's like, like my main 
issue. That's like the one thing I don't like about my skin is my pores and just the texture. So she told me to give this a try. Um, it's a lot more affordable than the Luna one. I think this is around like the 70, I don't know, 72, $78 mark. I can't really remember how much, but it's definitely not over a hundred dollars. And for people that live in Canada, this is actually a very affordable oil. This is very hydrating. It's very balancing for my skin. And that's one thing that I really like about it. It helps improve the redness, which I have had a lot of redness, um, just from like acne and just like sun damage and just things that would just like irritate my skin. Um, this really does calm it down and it helps with my blemishes as well too. My pores, yes. I have noticed that my pores have shrunk. Like they are 10 times smaller than they were before. I'm not even exaggerating this. Now I'm not saying this is gonna work for everybody because I have read reviews where people say that they have, didn't even notice any results and that's fine because everyone is going to react different to each product. That's just the way it is. That's how our bodies work. Like it's just not gonna be, um, it's not gonna work for everybody, okay? So don't get mad at me if you purchase it and it doesn't work for you, but for me it does and I'm just, I'm gonna share it with you guys. So this will not clog your pores. I have not noticed any clogging. It helps with blackheads. Like my blackheads have improved so much. I used to get a lot around my nose. And again, like this will help reduce the oil. So if you have combination skin and you're very oily, then this is a facial oil that I would definitely try. I only need about three, sometimes four drops on the palm of my hand. And the way that I put on an oil, I'll drop it in the palm of my hand and I'll just kind of pat it a little bit and then I will just pat it onto the skin and just pat, 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 and then I will like start smoothing it out. Whatever is left over on my skin, you guys, and that includes any of these products, I always go around my hands because believe it or not, your hands do wrinkle as well. So if you really wanna help your hands out, then definitely do that because you can tell the person's age just by their hands, really. Um, so that's what I do after I'm done is I make sure I just rub it into my hands after but you guys I'm telling you this stuff has changed my skin for life and I Love it. I just I love it. I highly highly recommend it. That is it for this video I hope it was helpful. I hope you found some products that might work out for you um, If you've tried any of these let me know in the comments down below if you recommend anything um, That has helped you if you have the same skin type as me, let me know because I always love trying new skincare products. I am not one to actually stick with the same skincare. I like to change it up. It's like my shampoo. I feel like my hair gets used to the same shampoo that I need to change it up every couple of months and then my hair is like back to normal again. So uh, yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and I will be uh, doing my AM video very, very soon. So take care guys.